Dear grade four students, this is Miss Sarah, and I'm gonna be your homeroom teacher who's gonna be teaching you English, math, and UOI, which is science and social studies. Well, this video is going to be a brief overview of the content and the skills that we're expected to implement in this subject, math, and this academic year. Math in grade four is going to be unique and special. Well, this year we will advance our knowledge and information in math. First of all, I would like to show you the book. You have volume one and also volume two as well. It is entitled Envision Mathematics Common Core, plus our math copybooks, of course. We're gonna practice on many different worksheets and activities in order to implement the skills we're expected and required to have. Well, Within the year, we might notice that we'll be having some topics that are in volume two, but we might take it in the first semester. Do not worry. So let's not worry about it. Uh, we will be covering the majority of all our topics in math. So now let's go into details of what we'll be taking in math this year. And of course, it's going to be fun. So we're gonna start the year with plays value. And when I say place value, I mean the value of a specific number. So for example, if I went to the supermarket and I have one JD, and my friend or brother or sister has 10 JDs. Now for sure, the value of one JD is totally different than the value of 10 JDs. 10 JDs can buy you more items than one JD because the value of 10 is actually bigger than the value of number one, right? So when we talk about math, we need to remember two important things, the value and the accuracy. In math, we need to be accurate. Why? For example, if I went to the grocery shop, for example, Cosmo or Miles, when I put my items that I need to buy on the cashier, I need to make sure that the money he or she gave me is accurate and that I gave the cashier the right amount as well. You know, you can't buy an item that costs 10 GD with another amount like 100. No way. So always remember to be accurate in math. In math, we're gonna be learning some basic operations, addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. We're gonna add two digit numbers plus two, di two digit numbers as well. Three digit numbers plus three digit numbers until we reach four digit numbers plus four digit numbers. We're gonna continue practicing subtraction and I'm gonna show you methods of how to check your work and your answers. Hopefully this year, you're gonna be more confident and more knowledgeable.